Choose your fighter. Lady Inspired. Do it. Do it. Hello, everyone. She's going to do side quests today. I'm going to do side quests. Did they added, I think, three new side quests in post game? Because I. I, I did side quests on my own account and I can't remember. Talk to the guy, talk to the guy, talk to the guy. Go talk to the guy. Yeah, instead of being one item, I think this guy gives three. Yeah, this guy gives you. Uh, there. No, you're going to use a new. So, yeah, they, they added an update, Casey. Yeah. So, this guy, instead of giving you one item every day, he gives you three items every day that you have the option of buying. Uh, they've increased. Oh, I already did it. What? I already did what, it. What, I told what did you. I get? Over. Back to your inventory. Everyday items. You got that. You got that. Oh! And you got that. Ultra ball? Do I get a recipe for ultra ball? No. Well, oh, later in the game. You gotta work on your Pokedex. But, um, yeah, they also added... I think they they made you... Run, they make you run faster now. I think you run faster than before. Oh, yeah, you told me about that. And then they, yeah, they added some side quest stuff. They, they added a bunch of... That is some cool stuff, essentially. It's nice. Yes. Well, you haven't even picked up all the side quests yet. Look, there's still side quests all around here. Yes, I know. Up. I Got win. It. It's eight two. No, it wasn't. Utter fucking betrayal. No, no Will. Casey's betraying me. God, I can't call my mount. Nope. I feel run. like I'm running in sand. See, see how much they... I think they increased the speed, didn't, didn't you think so? No. They definitely increased the speed of your run. Uh, I think you have to come back at night. I don't remember. I know it's yeah, that. Talk to the guy. Talk to the guy, maybe? No, you have to come back in the evening. Uh, I come think back it's in the morning. evening, then get fun. Get fudged. Give me a phone! God! What are you streaming? Play the game! Mother. seen a cow give birth yes have you live birth. have you seen what happens when it pushes too hard yeah it fucking it's entire fucking inside tracks also flop out oh you have to talk to this person first casey you, you haven't even started the quest you gotta talk to her first and then it starts the quest well no because i have the quest i yes you have to talk to her first so have you accepted my request to look into the drift loon I can't tell you what a big help that is. Let me fill you in. We've heard reports that a Drifloon was playing with one of the village children over Prelude Beach in the evenings. That's creepy. It seemed like odd behavior for a Pokemon, so all of the security corps worried its true intentions were to harm the child in some way. Which it probably is. I'm gonna eat it. Because it's a Drifloon. I'm gonna eat the child. We're gonna eat. What does Drifloon taste like? Probably helium. You ever taste helium? It's a ghost. Oh. I don't think you can eat a ghost. Um, for those who don't know, Drifloon's entire thing is that it kidnaps children that are bad and then drops them from high high places to kill them. Thank for those you. who didn't know, yeah, it kidnaps children by lifting them up and then dropping them from really high heights. Thankfully, all the village children were safe and accounted for when we went to check on them, but there was one curious thing. None of them seemed to know anything about a Drifloon. But well, so many people from the village have reported seeing the Pokemon. We can't simply pretend there isn't an issue here. Wow, seeing an issue and actually wanting to resolve okay, it. Okay, Casey, we're not talking about work. Since this calls for some investigation, I thought the survey corpse would be our best bet. Don't make work your personality. I'll try. <laughs> we need you to find out the truth. I, it's like trauma. <laughs> we need to find out the truth behind the drift loon. Yeah, okay. So investigate. The rest of the quest, I swear to f This quest is easy. Wow, you're amazing. I want to partner Pokemon too. Wrong kid. 
Hey, 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 sh survey lady. Know what you need to do to be a super awesome member of the galaxy team? Be an adult. Nope. I mean, I guess that's also important, but you need to have a partner Pokemon. Mine's literally right there. You can see it from behind, from right here. With a partner Pokemon backing you up, you'll be strong as strong as 100 people. I really want to catch a Pokemon on my own someday, so I've been throwing balls to get my aim spot on. Now I think, now I think I'm ready to practice with real Pokeballs. I bet you have loads of them since you're in the Survey Corps and all. Think you can give me just five of your Pokeballs, please? You don't even have Pokeballs. Yeah, I do. You have great balls. <laughs> you have to craft Pokeballs, KZ. You don't have any plain Pokeballs. You can't even craft any. You don't have apricorns. Fuck. You, it's because you use them all to great make great balls. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this quest is easy. <laughs> this quest is easy, she says. Yeah. Um. They had yeah. I think three new post game quests. Oh, Casey. Are you going to just buy them? Just buy five. Easy. God, the things I do for children. You spent 500 bucks on children. Well, in reality, it's Pokey Dollars. So if, isn't, if I'm mistaken, every Pokey Dollar is equivalent to a penny in, in uh, US currency. Uh, how do I jump again? Uh, B. Yep, B. I don't remember. It's a button. Why? The easy quest. Give me five Pokeballs, damn it. <laughs> the bar is shanky. Before I fucking get my knife out. Woohoo! Now I can catch a partner Pokemon of my own. Sure, kid. Here's a reward just for you. Some grit dust. It was super hard to collect, so I hope you like it. If you want to know more about what it does, you can ask Captain Zizu. She knows all about it. Grit dust is very important. Yeah, just let me know when you end up finding Pokemon uh, that you like. Okay, this is going to be like my final team kind of level Pokemon. Oh, like... oh, stop. Oh, sorry. If you find a Pokemon that'd be, that'd be a great partner for me, let me know and I can go catch it. I'll let you know because it's probably going to be. Um... Yeah, just let me know because then I can tell you because then you, that's who you want to use Grit Dust on then. Yeah, it's. Uh, so what does Grit Dust do exactly? Increases their. E, uh, IVs, I think. It, it makes them better. Gives them, makes them super strong. Super strong. strong. But, uh... Yeah, get the last quest, please. I know you I know you do this just because you love to fucking torture me, but I, I just really want you to get the last quest because it's really counterproductive if you don't have all the quests and just do them all at once. I think I'm missing the Bidoof. It's inside. It's in the building. Like, please, just work with me. This, you know, we're supposed to be a team, and you always try to do things that bug the fuck out of me. Oh, uh, okay. Purpose. So, last night I was playing Little Big Planet, right? You're welcome. Huh? Yes, you're welcome. Yeah. Uh, Will bought a PS3, and he has Little Big Planet, which is one of my probably top five favorite games ever. And so I was playing it, and I'm like, hey, Will, if you can imagine, when I used to play this with my sister, uh, it was very chaotic, because they would want to finish the levels, and I'd just be a devil. I never noticed Rowlet up there. What a massive mushroom. See, there's two. <gasps> okay, I know the first quest we're doing is that quest right here. A particular ponyta. It's the first quest we're doing peculiar? for the day. It's peculiar, yep. We're, we're doing that one. That's the first quest we're doing today, Casey. I don't give a shit what you say. We're doing that quest. Okay. Says who? Uh, says me. I'm taking the reins of this train right now. Uh, we're doing that quest first. You can do any other quest after that, but we're doing that quest first. Okay? A pony tie. Yeah, we're doing that quest first, okay? I'm sorry, but it has to happen. Well, what do I get in return? Uh, you'll find out. Level 19 quest. No, it's the 19th quest. Oh. They're in order. They're supposed to be in order. If you actually, well, you not... can actually organize them. Well, ha okay. Sort. Have... Why? Now they're in order. There's a I think a hundred and something. 
quests. Okay, well, I'm gonna do these side quests too. Okay, well, for, like I said, first things first, just do the ponytail quest. You can do whatever one after that, but just do the side quest one. Do the ponytail one first, please. Please. <laughs> please. Yeah. You're not even doing. <laughs> I, no, I I followed it. <laughs> I'm doing it, Will. <laughs> Fucking get me out of doing it. Uh, you're here about the ponytail request, right? Glad to have some help at last. Here's the problem: ponytail, like no one, uh, no one's ever seen a seen before, has appeared in the ho horseshoe plains. The horseshoe. The horseshoe plains. It looks so different than the other ponytail. It's a little scary, to be honest. Honestly, I think I shit myself a little just looking at it. But when I told the professor, he got all excited about researching it, so he agreed to have the ponytail re surveyed and see what's up. What's the professor what? Professor got all excited. It's like, ooh. <laughs> if you'd head to the horseshoe plains and, and catch that strange ponytail for us, I'd really help. It'd really help us out. So go I, catch the strange ponytail. Uh, Halloween ponytail. <gasps> oh, okay. So I didn't do this quest in mine because I thought the horseshoe plains was like after the Meyer lands or something no it's just it's inside the first zone oh, okay. it's a sub zone in a in the zone get in the zone auto zone gross wow those darn people. those darn but do you do oh that's another quest okay yeah. oh sorry Oh my god, Casey, Sorry. I hate this. I have a job that's perfect for a high achiever like you. I can't stream with you, Casey. See, I need Not with you can charge. I can't stream with Casey uh, in charge of the remotes. Pesky B-Doof again. You wanted me to play this. I can't stream with Casey in charge of the remotes. <laughs> she skips everything. She skips everything. Even even when she wants to I, read things, she away, skips it. I look away for one second and the little scoundrels waltz right into the village. Oh, this is awful. I'm a complete failure as a member of the security corps. Yeah, yeah, because you stood by and watched them go in whatever how can i face captain suzu like this probably beat your ass no get a hold of yourself uh just catch the beat and everything will be fine but still three beat is a lot two more than i think i could handle on my own in fact what a weak bitch oh i have an idea why don't you do my job sound familiar i've heard that these particular uh, particular pests get easily distracted if other beat are nearby and end up letting their guard down around humans if you bring Beedoof to draw their attention, I can seize that chance to catch a little troublemakers. Voila, the perfect plan. If we combine forces, we'll all get three caught in no time at all. Even when Casey wants to read something, just skip the dialogue by accident. I mean, it's fine. <laughs> yes, right in there. Might as well go to the field camp. I think it's closer. I think it's closer. Is there another question in this area? You can pull up the map. Just to double check. A quest? No, they pulled up the map. Because it might be in like the other camp. No, you're good. Okay. I guess it doesn't spawn until later. Okay. You got this. Got oh, okay. <laughs> oh, is it like a purple pony top? Oh, it's a shiny. It's a shiny pony top. Oh, it's an unusual pony top. Pony. Yeah, you gotta top. catch it. Where am I? I would recommend, recommend using a fucking jet ball, strongest of those kind of balls. If you went over one more, it would have had a. One more. One more. There you go. That's what happens when you find a shiny Pokemon in this game, by the way. Yeah, I would just chuck the fucker at it. Jet balls are great. They're my favorite type in this game. You right over its head. Right over its head. You gotta aim lower, Casey. 
Ah, oh, you're too far away. Yeah, you, know, you need a lot closer than that. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, you got the unusual ponyta. Report back to the guy in the village. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Look, all their star lorries. Oh, uh, okay. I can't knock them. Man, Dragon Quest kind of ruined me because whenever I'm on a mount, I'm just like, oh, I'll just run into enemies. Time to go home. You did it. Yay! I'm gonna have this in my party. Yeah. Shiny ponyta. 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 Shiny ponyta. Ponyta. Yes, 20 points! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! You did it! You I did, did it! it. You I did, did it! it. Hooray! I don't know. Oh, don't forget to talk to this guy. He also gives you quests, but he won't give them to you until you talk to him. It's fine. That'll be you the don't one... want to do the photography stuff, Casey? Is he going to... As a photographer, you don't want to do the photography stuff? As a photographer, do I want to be told the same thing three days in a row? Stop. <laughs> Stop bringing your problems into this. No. It's the perfect place to bring my problems into. I see you caught the strange ponyta. The sur your survey corpse folks... Uh, your survey corpse folks sure don't mess around. You know, a friend of mine from Galler was surprised when he saw the ponyta herds out in the fieldlands. He couldn't wrap his head around their fiery manes. At the time, I thought it was an odd t thing to be amazed by. But now that I know some ponyta have blue flames, it's not so... It's not such a stretch to think... Hey, Habit. How are you doing? There might be all sorts of them out there. Hi, Onyx. <laughs> and I'm not just talking about ponytail out mind. Who knows how many different colored Pokemon there are in the world? I hope the Survey Corpse keeps trying its le level its level best to research them all. Research them all! You did it, and you get to keep the ponytail. Uh, we're doing alright, Casey's, uh... I'm doing the best. So, as I was saying before, Casey's big problem is that even when she it's wants not a to problem. when she wa even when she wants to read dialogue, she'll accidentally just skip through it and not and not realize. Alex wanted to jump on my chair but then realized there's not enough room. It's really making me uh Depressed. struggle. Oh. <laughs> having Casey have the remote. You wanted me to play this. Oh, I'm stop playing it. My leg. I'm playing it my way. By skipping through literally everything. Yeah. Oh my god, is that... Where's the ponyta? There's oh, like you're in path barrel. four. That's why. Ponyta. Oh, I need to... What? I need to go catch a bee doof. You're gonna put the ponyta on your, your party? Oh, hang on. You I should realize... do it because it'll give you more experience for that ponyta. Just saying. You should do it ahead of time. But my ponyta's level 26. Hey, do you not, do you not want the ponyta or? I do, but it's like 11 levels behind. Then don't have the ponyta then. But I want it. Then put it in your fucking party. I don't know what to do. Anyway. <laughs> oh, no, you don't need to catch a doof out there. You need to catch a doof in the village. But I need a doof to catch a doof. You have a doof. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. It's in your... Thing. No, it isn't. I yeah. just checked, Will. It's in your thing. You don't need to read to pass this game? I know you don't, but how I do it is that I read everything, and how Casey plays games is that she skips everything. So it's really hard trying to find an equal bounds where, you know... And 
it's not well it's not games that have chapters upon chapters of dialogue it's also when oh alpha b dude look at the background <laughs> look at the big boy <laughs> you see him casey mm -hmm. you must get him you must get him he's so big you throw a pokeball at him if you went around Oh, hey, no, it's me. Yeah, now you gotta fight him. Big boy. <laughs> oh. Level 18? Yeah, you can catch him. Have you ever seen the Alpha Bidoo? Yeah. <clears throat> some, al so, some Alpha Pokemon spawn in very, you know, static zones, but most of the Alpha Pokemon in this game actually just spawn randomly. So like for instance this beauty I've also never seen this beauty here before, but it just randomly spawned here. Oh handy. I can actually Yeah, if use you that. if you fight if you um just as a heads up, if you fight Alpha Pokemon and either catch them or kill them, they drop special items like candy or grit dust, oh, things like that. I know. I've fought uh, of the barrel several times. True, you can also throw mud at his face. Onyx is currently murdering a, a pencil. I hate how it won't just let you go back to the village. You gotta talk to the boy. You caught two b b -doos. I'll release the rampage one in the village. Oh my face. Stop picking at it. Yeah, what? Face. Anything I was talking about. Little light. Hey, hey, hey. 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 He's complaining, Casey, because he wasn't fed for the fifth time today. <laughs> hey, Onyx, you don't need food. You're fed enough. Yeah, so Onyx was murdering the pencil, and then he tried to get into the cabinets. Big Bidoof. You know, if you don't want that Bidoof, you can keep it. I'll take it once Pokemon Home is synced up. What do you mean, poor Onyx? He's fucking he needs round. No, no, he's not on a diet. That's the problem. He needs to go on a diet. The boy is like a fucking circle. I'll get Big Bidoof. He has Charge Beam. Big boy. Well, no, don't change it. It's too late. No, don't change it, Will. I update it's been... it. I'm updating it with everything. No, you don't need Stop to. Stop telling me what to do. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Get Every Side Quest. I want to be a circle like him. Dude, I want to be a circle. I can't use the alpha one. You can't. Can you? Oh. Are you sure you can? I'm pretty sure. Uh, uh, maybe... Okay, well, let me try. Let me try. Alpha, I, guess I, guess, I, guess, I guess I just can't throw it. Yeah, see, there you go. Easy. Fucking unit. Caught it! Great going, team! What a fucking unit! <laughs> Holy shit! <sighs> I love him, Casey. I love him. I wonder where the other Redoof could be. Well, I know. Okay. I think I know. I already did this quest. <laughs> you better cause some problems or else. Ooh, boy. Big B Doof is gonna fucking beat the shit out of small B Doofs. B Doof. That's two. Oh, the third one was like super hard. <laughs> 
chomp, chomp. Peter just shits himself. <laughs> You're a machine. You're a machine. Hey, where's the third one, Casey? You got this. Uh, the third one, like, was really hard to get because it blended in. I didn't see it. Oh, where is it? I think my thoughts are too fast. I don't really skip words. So, I, I, so what I type makes no sense. Oh, you're all good. Wait, that blended in? Or I couldn't... I had trouble finding it because from far away it blended in with the fence. Definitely looks like a fence to me. You got it. Good job. Hooray! I mean, they're all fine, but they're not like my Bidu. <laughs> I swear, that puts all the little troublemaker safety in our custody. Now give him the old heave-ho. It'd be a shame to just send this Bidu back into the wild, no? My construction corpse would find a use for him. Oh, you want to keep them? But these not a... Naughty nibblers have caused so much trouble for the construction corpse. They're just Pokemon being Pokemon. They're just human. How are they supposed to know our village is a strict no chewing zone? Shows good taste in their part to come all the way here to gnaw in our woodwork too. That just reminds me of um I saw a documentary of foxes in the suburbs. And we have beer. I'm like it was this documentary, and you know a guy kills a fox on camera? He kills a fox on camera while it's wrapped? Yeah. And the whole time when I was watching this documentary, I'm like, the foxes were here first? I don't understand why people are getting so... What? Why people are getting so pissy, just like, oh, they're in my yard. Just like, dude, you are in their territory. Inside the porch. Yeah, I mean, the people talking in the fucking documentary, I would like to kick the shit out of that guy. Yeah, he he tells the camera to turn away, and then you just hear a... Fuck. Yeah, and so, <clears throat> um, the people in this documentary, they're just like, animal haters, I guess. Just like, yeah, the fox comes into my backyard and messes with my children's toys. And it's like... Those are the kind of people that deserve to be purged. Yeah. <laughs> Just like, what the fuck? Just like, you built a home in their territory. Sometimes the purge does sound like a good idea. Purge for days. If they're gonna stay here, they'll have to help with our work. They got the guts <laughs> to keep trying to get into the village, plus the teeth smash through trees and rocks. Just what our corpse needs. But it was... It was kind of funny because one fox, there was like an animal or a fox expert, mm -hmm. and she wanted to lay a trap to move them like back out into the wild. And so they uh, laid a, like three chicken eggs in so the fox would get it. So the fox somehow managed to get the three chicken eggs out from the cage but not actually get trapped and then left a, a fat shit outside of it. <laughs> As, like, a middle finger. That's what I wanted to hear. Hmm, I'm not convinced this lot have it in them to do an honest day's work. But if Sanqua's watching over them, I'm sure it'll work out alright. So I guess that's settled. Thanks again for your help. Stopping me, assholes. I am too far and take this shit with you. I don't think it was. Ooh, you got a rare candy. You know you can give, it, give, it, put that rare candy. Yeah. With the pony saw. Pony saw. <clears throat> Part of me wants to keep this Alpha Bidu, but I like Luxio more. You keep him a Bidu forever. Okay, so you guys change out the pony saw or not? I am. You are okay. I'm changing things out because it's prettier. Welcome to society. Now it's a shiny. You guys now I can switch it out. Oh, it's not shiny on here. Hmm. That's disappointing. It's shiny on here. You see this, guys? Shiny on here. 
not shiny on here. Oh, that's... What if I try this? Bah. No, still not shiny. You only care about them being pretty, so artificial. Yeah! Sometimes I care about how they function. Only Often. sometimes, though. Only sometimes. Like, Umbreon is my favorite because of the way it looks. That's, that's pretty much it. Okay, like I said, you can... Now that the point all quest is done, you can do any quest you want. I don't give a shit. Because you said you want to do side quests anyways. Yeah. I'm just going to go in order. I still had, you still got to catch an Alpha Weasel. Alpha Weasel, yeah. I'll do How it. good are your dabs? Him with the... Uh, uh. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes I like thank, the way thank you for the redeem, for the redeem dabs habit. You know, sometimes I like uh Pokemon for the way they look and their OP status like Cinderins. Yeah, for so for context habit, so the reason that redemption exists is because uh Casey and I used to work polar opposite schedules. But in the pure blue moon, whenever I was home, he would constantly ask me to dab whenever I walked into the Not room. Not just me. But it's but the you know. people. So she made, she wanted to make a redemption to where I was for if I was home, I'd be forced to come on and dab. Spawned out of nowhere, the etherealness. Well, so did I. I came out of the sky butthole. True. Butthole in the sky. Save all the points for dabs. Um, um, hey, I, I want to go home now, but Drifter will let me. He's talking about killing me in my sleep. See, I'm like just behind him. Just... I like the way you smell, kid. <laughs> can you help me, please? Uh... Can do. Max the bee do. <laughs> Yay, now I can finally go home. It's been three days. <laughs> but hey, uh, Drifton didn't mean to be bad. That just reminds me. It's like, well, this is stupid. There's no room up here. That's what we've been trying to tell you. We've been stuck up here for three days. We told you you wouldn't fit in. <laughs> <laughs> it, always played, it always played together with me. It's really friendly. So I kept it a secret from everyone. That's why I wouldn't let me leave. For three days. For three days. Oh, my name is Taki. See you around, Survey Corpse Lady. Fuck you, Taki. Yay, report back to Mickey Mickey. Mickey Mickey. Yeah, so, uh, just saying, and certain, certain quests are only available as well when you catch specific Pokemon. So if you're, if you're like, you see your order and it goes like, oh, one through like 20. And it skips to like 23. It's because you're missing Pokemon that you need to catch. Mm. Mickey Mouse? Yeah, fuck him. I see you've been looking in, into that worrisome Drifloon for us. What have you found out? He's dead now. I smacked him. I see. So Little Taki was trying to keep Drifloon from getting in trouble. Fuck him right up the ass. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. <laughs> At the same time. Oh. <laughs> Give him the old dick twist. Give him the good old dick twist. He was in considerable danger. Without your help, goodness knows where Drifling would have taken him by now. I'd be remiss if I didn't follow up this double incident. I'll urge Captain Zizzer to post extra security corps around the beach. I don't think the situation will be resolved in the currently and everyone's safe. Good job, Casey. Yeah. Look, well, you got Stardust. You're doing great, Casey. Keep up the good work. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Woo! 
Woo! On to the next one. You got dust from a star. Don't worry, it's not that valuable. Zubat's eyes. How, yeah, how is dust from a star so common, you'd think? Well, that. That's not a star, that's a different dimension. Uh, from that. <laughs> You need a zoo bag. Also, why are your boxes... Why do your boxes look like this, Casey? Did I released some Pokemon. Yeah, why don't you just put them all in the same box? Why don't you stop telling me how to live my life? And the suitcase the suitcase feels like it's full of rocks. Hey, it is full of rocks. Patrick, why is your suitcase full of rocks? And I'll tell you how to live your life. <laughs> I found out about the boss you were telling me about. That mm, dude, okay. Have it though. <clears throat> so you finally fought the boss. The music for that boss, though. Oh, I helped will find the cave boss because he's like, I've been looking for hours. I cannot find the cave. I'm like, okay. So you see that guy just sitting there. You go left. There it is. I never saw that cave. This is all you. Hi, Clarissa of the Survey Corps. That's me. Thanks so much for taking on my request. I need you to catch a zoo bed and show me so I can take a look at its eyes. Odd crest, I know, but I have good reason for it. Zoo bed never seemed to have trouble flying around in pitch darkness. That means their night vision must be top notch. If I could learn how to see in the dark, I like them. Night, sh night shifts on guard duty would be a breeze. <laughs> so I'm coming. I'm counting on your help. Get to do bench. Come sh show it to me, please, please. Uh, the cave with the uh the wolves. I'll take a look at the pepper peeper pepper peepers. If you I'll please, do that. Boy, it got no eyes. Oh, where are your eyes, little guy? Don't tell me it doesn't have eyes. But then that means Zubat flies around being completely blind? Hmm, Zubat must have some other kind of secret sense if it doesn't even need eyes. Ah, that's amazing and all, but it hardly helps me. What am I going to do about my nighttime shifts on guard duty? Oh, man. Oh, that's a good idea. I need, need for me to go alone after all. A little help would be great. That's that then. I'll go up there and try and find a zoo, but I can help me with my partner. But I just have Thanks a zoo for the great for advice. I have a zoo bat for you right here. That was my first zoo. Yeah, I, I never saw the cave up until the point where Casey had to show me because I physically could not find it. I almost didn't want to kill the boss in the first try because I was like, oh. exactly. I, was like, I just want to relax and listen to the music because the boss itself isn't even bad, you know? It's like, I don't want to destroy this boss. I have to catch his Geodude and give it to Geodude. They're behind you. I have to go. No, no, you, you, you can give it to him from your inventory, from your PC. Oh. Yeah, 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 Oh my, would you look at that? I'm a good big goober rock! It really does look like a rock, and it seems to be the ideal weight too. Oh, it's just simply perfect, yeah. Oh, thank you, young lady. With the Geodude's help, I'm sure to make uh, some scrumptious pickles. So she's in a, she wants the Geodude... Make to pickles? No, she wants the Geodude to sit on the pot to make sure the lid stays on. That's all she wants the Geodude for. Well, this is cool. I thought um, I was supposed to kill it using Torrid, uh, using Defy, but then I tried to mount him, uh, to mount him, and it wouldn't let me. But so good. Yeah, I go ponytail. Good job. 
Good job. Yeah. yeah. Hey, good job. Next quest. Timber of the fields. Wow. Yeah, this is the very bottom quest. Basically, what you mean, like, what I mean, like, you're missing 25, but you have 24 and 26. It's because you're missing a Pokemon to, mm. to get that quest. But once you get the Pokemon, then the quest will appear. Yep. Sure that's why you should always catch every Pokemon, every Pokemon as much as you can. You need at least one, one of every Pokemon in your Pokédex. On top of that, <laughs> now, damn, what a, what a sad life, dude. What a sad life. Yeah, that's all. That's all it's good for. For the rest of his life, he's just gonna sit on top of that fucking lid. What quest do you do now? Good question. Oh, hi. How you doing? Okay, shit. Let's see what. Organize this, maybe. Oh my god. Maybe. Casey wants to organize something? Oh, wait. This is. I don't have a completed um, Pokédex for Cricket Town. I don't think so. What do you mean? Uh, I have a quest. No, um, yeah. There's certain ones you have to get a, t a 10 ranking in. Dude, see. I'm so excited for Gen 9. Have, have you seen. Okay. Have it. this one. Yeah, you have to go find an alpha one. Have you have you seen the graphical comparisons from uh, like the model comparisons from Gen from Sword and Shield to the Gen Nine sneak peek? Because if not, I can I can post them in the Discord. Yeah, we cat. They look really good. Like the Magnemite, the Magnemite looks so good. It's actually reflective, like metal. What? A <laughs> Pokemon made of metal? I hate the hippos. Yeah, I think I think the environment itself could use some work because it looks it doesn't look as good as because okay, Legends Arceus has its kinks, but you know it it it's stylized. In my opinion, it looks worse than Legends Arceus. So if they bring the the environment up a bit, I think the game will be great. I think the game will be fantastic, like. Appearance wise story and gameplay. It's another story, but appearance wise it'll look good But it is just, they still have like what eight or nine months before it'll theoretically be released So they got time to fix all that Weasel where are you? You just need big boy weasels and if you yeah, if you can find an alpha which, like I said, weasels, alpha weasels, one of those ones that just randomly spawn. But if you can find an alpha, uh, it's always going to be big. So it's always going to work. Look, level two. Weasel. Dude, I totally got this. So have out of the three, which which starter are you going to choose? Casey's already chosen hers. Might be that they are still working on because yeah, exa exactly. Like they they got plenty of time to fix it. Yeah, large species. Actually, that one that one's perfect. It should be. Hey, Ashes, how you hey, doing? Hey, Ashes. Yeah, Casey's gonna choose Weed Cat. Right, Casey. How do I check which one I? Oh, we go up. To the cricket hut. I thought you. I, I saw you. Put you on cricket hut. Okay. Go ZR. For me. Large, I think, is good. Now go down. I thought you. I saw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a tenant on Krikatot. You can turn the quest in. Oh. As long as you have a tenant, it, it works. I want the Fukoko. Is Fukoko's the uh the pepper, right? The pepper crocodile. Cause I want I want that one. He looks so cute. Yeah, I want him. He looks cute. The little pepper crocodile. Yeah, it's going good, Ashes. It's finally raining He's so or sprinkle cute. in California, which is nice because we haven't had rain in months. Ukoko will be best boy. Yeah, I hope this should work because it's a large, large size. 
You just have to go talk to the guy and see. Yeah, Weed Cat, we got Pepper Boy, and we got Little... We got Weed Cat, Pepper Crocodile, and Little German Boy. Those were the starters for Gen 9. Fresh Rain, exactly. Fresh rain. Yeah, everyone is just giving shit to the duck. Everyone's getting giving shit to the duck. Poor duck, dude. He's a little German boy. Did I tell you that um my my friend Katie she had a Tinder profile of a goose? Yes, you told me. And so whenever she would match with someone, they'd be like, "Hey, how's it going?" She'd be like, "Quack quack quack quack," just as a response. Quack quack. <laughs> quack quack. I don't know if she still has it. Yeah, yeah it should be big enough. Because it's large species. Yeah. You bring me one so quickly. I'm afraid I'm looking for a bigger one, though. How big is this one? Wait. It's a large species. It should be fun. The fuckity is this bullshit. Well, at least I can turn in the cricket tot. You can. You just gotta... Find the person to turn into. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you haven't picked up the quest. No, I I have. Unless you already turned in the quest. You gotta give that person. Oh, yeah. stuff. <laughs> let me let me do this. It's, it's inside the main building. Yeah. Yeah, he wants us two eight or bigger. But I thought because it was a large species, it, it'd be big enough. It might be an inch too small. It genuinely might be an inch too small. It might be a two two foot seven. Fuck. It took me thirty weasel to find one that was two foot eight. No, I'm just gonna do quests that I can actually just do in Jubilife City and then go out. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, you should check its summary when you can and see if it how big it is. If it's two foot seven, that'd be so sad. Oh, if the necessary comes for clue to quell the Lord of the Woods, is that choice? And girl, are you? It's so weird because. Since it was raining today, I'm just like, okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna wear something I don't wear. And I'm wearing white, and it feels very bizarre. I didn't know white clothes wrinkle so much. Don't waste your breath. I've got nothing to sell to him and his store anyways. Now go on, scurry. Pestering me for good when I'm already tearing my hair out, to, out trying to get a hearty grains. She. Wait, you've got hardy grains? Would you let me have some? Please, just three stalks. Oh, yes. Oh, hardy grains, the crimson mire, oh, the finest grains. feature. The swale of golden brown stalks across the landscape. It fills me with the yearning for home. I'd wager if you combine hardy grains with other ingredients, it'd bring out tasty aromas. That would make Pokemon gather around. All right, I won't send you you back a failure since you so kindly brought me these hearty grains. Yeah, when are you gonna audition for voice acting? <laughs> Del Joy, I'll set him up with some new wares. To do voice acting. Uh, haha. <laughs> sure, sure, buddy. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. <laughs> Hey, bud, there's recipe cards on how to do voice acting. I need to pursue voice acting. Yeah, that's, that's going to be my side job. I'm going to be a voice actor. Yep, 100%. I, I have the capacity to do that. I mean, you went to college to be an artist, but what happens if you're a voice actor? I wouldn't even know where to start with that, Casey. Well, you audition first. That would be your side bitch of work, yeah. <laughs> you got your main and your I've side. Got, I've got good news, news. I've got news goods in stock, thanks to you. I'm sorry you have to deal with all this. How, how, 
Tao Hao, uh, Hua, Tao Hua, and I have had some complications before. But thanks he to you, I've I <laughs> got excellent new kind items to offer. Do buy some. Hey, new items in the shop. New items in the shop. Yeah, you, he sells new items for you. Congratulations. Oh, here it is. Go. Okay, I have to go outside. Oh, we got a PS5 for sale now. New items! Ooh. Oh, okay, this is the cricket. Hi there, you're that go-getter from the survey corpse, right? I have a request for you if you got some time. I'd love to know a Pokemon called Rose. Rosalia has a scourge yeah. right in the flower's pants. Such a graceful Pokemon. I often come by the Golden Lowlands to admire the Rosella. Just, but just watching them from afar isn't enough for me anymore. Do you think you can complete Rosella's page in the Pokédex of yours and show it to me? Yeah, sure. Just throw, chuck a PS5 out of it. It totally won't kill the Pokemon. Oh, I started reading two new web comments and they're both on. Ice. Yeah, that sucks, Ashes. That sucks. Hey, look at that quest. I'm not going to pick that one up yet. Oh, by the way, so you see how this Pokemon's up there, right? Those are mass outbreaks, and mass outbreaks have a higher chance of you finding a uh, shiny. shiny Pokemon. I'm trying to get out of the... What? I'm trying just to go back to the field land. You have to leave. Just leave. Talk. No, just leave. Talk, talk to him and leave. Like you would any other zone. Yeah, let's return to the village. But I don't want to turn to the village and then go back out. You have out. to every time. That's stupid. <laughs> you have to. Yeah, so that's that's one of the big things they're... Um, that's one of the big things they're at, they're doing for Gen 9. One of the, their big advertisements for it is that you'll be able to travel from area to area and city to city. So the game is going to be kind of like this, but instead of having to load in every single time like they're doing right now, It'll be, it's supposed to be a seamless transition. See, there shouldn't be, you shouldn't have to load in every time. Like the Witcher. Because you can go yes. from, you can yeah. go from Velen to Novigrad. Uh, you can't go to White Orchard, but you can go from Velen to Novigrad seamlessly, even though they're two zones. You complete a Krigatod's Pokedex page? Great, quickly now, let me have a look. Yeah, it's going to be really good. Oh, so Cricket Top produced that curious sound of theirs by hitting their antenna together. Hmm, I wonder if Advin from the Supply Corps could put together an instrument with a similar shape to those antennae. Well, for now, thanks for going out of your way to solve this uh, tonal enigma. Here, take these. Oh my gosh, you have Vivid Chokes. Uh, vivid Chokes are used to make uh, revives. I haven't played Breath of the Wild. You need to still. I only played 20 minutes. You still need to play Breath of the Wild or something. I, I know I need to play. Uh, oh. It feels like I play a game and then a Zelda game and then a game and then a Zelda game. So, like me with Final Fantasy? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Pokemon page in your Pokedex. You need to catch and battle that species over and over, right? Gosh, you're such a hard worker. Well, eventually you'll play every Zelda game, KC. Zelda is loved. So you still need Big Weasel. Yeah. Go find Big Weasel. The only time I've ever seen an Alpha Weasel spawn is in the rain. Hey, Andy. Hey, Andy. I would play Breath of the Wild, but I have no Switch. Honestly, though, the only reason we even have a Switch is because I got it for Christmas, uh, what, two years ago? You didn't get it for Christmas. You got it randomly. No, I got it for my, no, I got it for Christmas for my brother and sister. It wasn't for Christmas. It, it was, was for Christmas. It was random. Nope. Because they're just like, hey, or it was like a late birthday gift. The exact same way. Hey, Andy. Hi. Look, is that a weasel? 
I can't hear you. I can't hear you. You're my other ear. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, you caught a weasel. Good job. Good job. Good job. It would probably unless someone gets me for me or if they release Twilight Princess for it. Ooh, a Twilight Princess on the Switch, dude. Imagine a Twilight Princess remaster on the Switch, dude. That means I could probably actually go into Hyrule Field. And not have the audio glitch. Aren't weasels? Uh, yeah, They're because imposters. it's nighttime, uh, you're not going to find Weasel. You're only going to find Drifloon. Oh, fuck. You got to reset fuck. the time. I don't know how. Go to the camp. You can teleport to any blue spot. Dude, imagine. I know Majora's Mask is gonna, is on Switch now. But you have to you have to pay for the uh the upgraded subscription price to play it. I didn't know you had to re I didn't know you could rest at the camps. Yeah. Change time of day too. <gasps> and it's raining. And if fully this 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 is how you fully heal your Pokémon. So instead of going to a Pokémon <gasps> center, you rest at camps. I didn't know that. Yeah. And it's raining. It's sprinkling just like in California. <laughs> you say California, but it's just uh where we live. California. We live in California. All of California is raining right now. Weather. <laughs> you have to port it from the Wii U also. Yeah, yep. Oh, okay, okay. Habit. So I was mentioning this to Will. You heard right? it before it stops raining. Walk and talk. I was mentioning this to Will, yeah. So Will's super happy. We're both happy about getting the PS3, right? Oh yeah. And so he's like, dude, imagine if we got a if we got a Wii. And I'm like, or playing oh, games on the Wii. Imagine if we got a Wii. No, we're getting a Wii. Well, and I'm just like he's like, Oh, are you excited to play games on the Wii, dude? And I'm like, okay, if Switch is like an upgraded version of Wii and the controls are still buggy as all hell, no, I'm not excited. <laughs> So I'm gonna be honest. Straight up, the only reason I want a Wii is because of what you guys wanted. The only reason I want a Wii is because I want to play GameCube games on it. I want to play uh Coliseum and XD on it. The only re that's the only reason I actually want a Wii. And it's gonna happen. We're getting a Wii, Casey. Like it's inevitable. Hopefully the other Breezel's bigger. I only I've only ever owned three Wii games. I had Wii Sports, Wii Carnival, and okay, another Wii Sports. I'm not counting Wii Sports because it came with Wii Sports come with the Wii. Uh, I had Super Smash Bros. Brawl. I had Oh yeah, Andy, we posted something in the Discord for you. Look at the grass. I'm serious, I don't use the Wii so I can still Ooh. Abba, you should. Mmm. Mmm. We'll talk about it. <laughs> and they, yeah, and they primarily only appear on that coast that you were at, the Buizel. No, there's another one. <gasps> another coast? You should catch the Snorlax. Oh, you're talking about where the float still is? Or you will watch out. I'm thinking they kick your eye. It was it? I had Super Smash Bros. Brawl. I this had looks like a big one. Another game, and then I had Yu-Gi-Oh! Five Ds, dude. I think I still have Yu-Gi-Oh! Five Ds down in down in the game case. Give me a second. Okay, so how do I check my recently caught Pokemon? Log. Yeah, how do I check my Wii was shit and like was the shit and like oh yeah, I had a Wii. Um it broke. Yeah, so I had what was it? Yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh! Five D's Wheelie Breaker, dude. This is a game where you had to play Yu-Gi-Oh! While on the back of a motorcycle, because that's what the in 5Ds was all about. And you had to control, you had to race with the motion controls while playing Yu-Gi-Oh! 
and you could get bonuses essentially if you were winning the race in the game it's convoluted as fuck it came with free cards but i don't have them anymore. uncharted was the shit in 2009 changed my mind uh okay i'll try uncharted was okay <laughs> It was a I never super played it. weird game. I never played it. I never I only know who Nathan Drake is. And that and that blonde girl you showed me. No! Andy, no, don't go! <laughs> Andy said unfollowed. Andy, look what you did. Look at the destruction you caused. Yeah, I only know Nathan Drake and um the, the blonde girl that you showed me, Andy, and that's pretty much it. That's all my knowledge on Uncharted. I'm guessing they're like treasure hunters. 